in the land after a big win over Abilene last week. Gets set nine. Two receivers split either way. Powell in the backfield. Fake it to him. Sling near side. Pass caught. Hit made. Pick up of a yard. Maybe in the gun. Takes the snap, looks left, has time, fires far side. James wide open, catch 45, far sideline, shrugged out, moving it on their open possession. Play action for McIlvain from the gun, rolls right, throws on the move, chest high catches made. Out of being in the gun, two receivers left. Helmet high snap, Powell around the left edge, has some room, bounces it all the way to the far side, stretches it out, and he has slung out with a long of 44 that he hit last week. Snap, hold, kick is up, flying through. The shift around, trips right, ball on the far hash mark. McIlvain in the shotgun. Hand off to Powell, tries to pick his way. Knight Butler, a penalty flag flew right at the snap. The hands-on learning you'll get through any of our programs will set you on the right path for future success. College is for you. Not only can you- The state on the schedule for Central Arkansas, who get off the field and force a punt, Elias Vigil, at his own 28-yard line, bobbles the hard penalty from the Bears. That's 30 yards of penalties on this drive. Uh, and it's keeping this drive alive. That's the only thing keeping SUU. He does it again, hits it too hard, and all the way into the end zone at the T in Southern Utah. And he's on to the races. Central Arkansas, first and 10 at their own 32. Give to Powell again, jumps around one would-be tackler, scurries his way across the 35-yard line to... And I think he was looking deeper, but saw Barnes just settle in in front of the deep, def the deep defensive back and just delivered a nice pass. First and 10 at the four. It's, it's true, Powell just, he did not, he refuses to go down on just those arm tackles. Arkansas. Number 25 with 113 to play in the quarter over Southern Utah, who will receive the kickoff when we come back from Van Wagner. This is Thunderbird football on K. Third major penalty against the Central Arkansas defense. And that was already a nice return for Isaiah Wooden, who is an electric player. Gun, Wooden, two touches, both have been negative in the yardage department. And came out of nowhere and hauls it in. Miller with a touchdown toss, and the Thunderbirds are on the board. And Patrick with great, yeah, very likely, but Gold Day with the nice hands. He reached out down below him and snagged that out of the air. For Arkansas. Didn't see any receivers in that area. There's one off to the right. If you're watching that replay, you can see that receiver. Fitzgerald hands out, and there's the flag. So 15 more penalty yards. Central Arkansas is over 92 or over 90 yards. I didn't think they'd have seven points on the board with only 17 yards of offense. But you're right, though. Southern Utah has to find something. They've got to make some kind of adjustments to get this offense moving. Fill the field to the 36-yard line. Brought down from behind by Mason Stromstad and Josh Lopez. And that brings up a third down. Off to Powell. Jitterbugs around the left side. He's got room. 35-30. Sideline 25-20. And he escorts the defense to commit in. And then so quick, he bounces outside. Per play. For this prolific offense and Powell up to 70 rushing yards on the ground. Make some adjustments and they, the defense needs a stop here. 15 yards to 264 for Central Arkansas who lead by 10, third and seven. Get it going against as they've been very stout. I don't know if you noticed those line judges that fake the handoff, throw a far side, bowling broke the catch, gets a block from Wooden. He's stood up at the 28 yard line and a horde of white jerseys come. Miller's got the shotgun snap, fake the handoff, zip it near side, pass is caught by Patrick inside the 20 to about the eight for Southern Utah. Short of the line to gain, third down and manageable upcoming for the Bears. And again, Coleman Silver's left, shotgun snap back to McIlvain, rifles near side, man wide open, and he stumbles out of bounds at the sideline at about the 47. Stays in position on that cut, makes a good break. We saw his speed on the pick six last week against Western Illinois, and we see it there keeping up with the offense. Cut down by Cody Coleman for a pickup of seven yards. Call it eight, actually, as he fell forward and put the ball out. Second down. Third and three at the Southern Utah fifth. Three receivers left for McIlvain in the gun. Has the snap, looks left, looks for the turf, no good. And the Thunderbird defense gets a big hold. No good. Boy, that's huge. I haven't been able to run the football once again. Right. It's been a theme for them this year. But uh, defensively, I I'd say they're doing enough, though can certainly be better.
and offensively as Hunter Berman in the country. <laughs> and, and they're showing some of that on defense. They've got to be more consistent, though, on, on both sides of the ball, especially on offense. One matchup. A couple touchdowns of two different guys. It's, it's been an impressive night so far for, Ma for McIlvain. Southern Utah. The officials have been busy, busy tonight. These are two of the most penalized in their car into hold. Snap, hold, kick is up, it's low. And it drifts wide to the right, no good. So it this missed. <laughs> that's, a, that's exactly right. You know where the misters are great, though, Ryan, is I, I think they're a great draw. <laughs> Stays on his feet to the 45, and then a bunch of white jerseys come and corral him after a pickup of two yards, but two yards. Steps up in the pocket, throws far side. There's a cord with the catch at the sideline. Across the 50, stays on his feet, lunges forward through him. He leaped into the air. Second and 10 at the 33 of Central Arkansas. Miller claps the hands. Fakes the handoff to Lampson, bowls on the ground, fumble central. That much, but uh, the wet conditions hurting the Thunderbirds on that those last two plays. So with 2.38 to play in the third test, that leads the UAC. Shifts to the pistol on first down, two tight ends right. Richmond team penalty yards in the game for Central Arkansas. They're going to look back on this one and say, we might have won into Central Arkansas territory to the 47-yard line. Braden Whistler hasn't seen holes like this all season long, but it was an opportunity missed. The timing on that hit, it could not have been better. Andrew Hayes pleat with one second to go in the third quarter. Once again, Southern Utah gets a big play and the drive stalls. Uh, T-Bird's trying to commit the persuasion. Well, Elite 30 for 30 library. Exclusive access. And the biggest names in the game. ESPN Plus. The exclusive home of the complete 30 for 30 library. Exclusive access. Live events. ESPN Plus originals. The exclusive home of the conclusive access. Top leagues and tournaments. And the biggest name. Exclusive home of the complete 30 for 30 library. Exclusive access. Top leagues. The exclusive home of the complete 30 for 30 library. Exclusive access. ESPN Plus originals. The exclusive home of the complete 30 for 30 library. Exclusive access, top leagues and tournaments, and the biggest names in the game. ESPN Plus, live sports, thousands of live events. ESPN Plus. In the shotgun, claps his hands, has the snap, looks left, pressure comes, gets hit, gets it away, passes caught at the 40, tackle made short of the 27 on the hash mark, has the snap, gets it away, booming spiral punt, Wooden waves his left hand for a fair catch, go at their own 27-yard line, Justin Miller, shotgun snap, pressure up the middle, floats one far side, it's underthrown, and it's intercepted to Marion. Beavers either way, McIlvain in the shotgun. Helmet high snap, fake the handoff, tunnel screen, far side, caught 40, 35, and Barnes is chopped down at the 14. Bears lead, trying to ice the game right here. Pistol snap back to McIlvain, dumps it off in the flat, caught at the 20, 15 to the 10, angles in the near sideline, it's, excuse me, earlier today, this is a 21-yarder from the left hash, snap, hold, kick is up, plenty of leg, first and 10 for the Bears at their own 15, sprint out for McIlvain, nobody open, throws back across his body, and it's deflected away, claps his hands, chest high, snap, Runs out of time, pressure from behind. Purcell trips him up, and he's down back. Bunch to the right, Miller in the gun. Chest high snap, throws far side. Going for Patrick, he's hauled it in for the... Is alive in Cedar City. There's the snap, hold is down, kick is up. He got it. An eight-point lead, two men in the backfield. Hand off Powell, patiently waits, and this time is stood up by a slew of black jerseys for the normal. Second and nine. 
Fake the toss and McIlvain's going down. Anisi Pers on third and 14 with five minutes to go. McIlvain the snap, looks, looks over the middle, it's intercepted. So Miller, he motions Isaiah Wooden, hand off to Lampson, runs right, cuts up the middle, falls forward to the 20 left. Justin Miller the snap, four man rush, throws far side, man wide open, it's caught, Patrick at the 10, gets away into the end zone. That. Southern Utah's that. Wooden motions in, Miller sprint out to the right, looks, nothing there, looks, looks, gets rid of it, knocked down, incomplete. 2-0 atop the UAC standings and number two.